What's up everyone, it's Prometheus, and today I'm coming at you with a review of the Flare Signature Pro. So I've had this machine on my counter for about a month now, I've had enough time to pull quite a few shots and toy around with this machine, and I think it's time to come out with a review going over the pros and cons of something like this versus a traditional espresso machine for your house. So let's start with the pros list. First off, and the biggest thing that I can see as a pro, is there are no mechanical or electric pieces to break. All the pressure created on this machine is done by hand. All the pieces are standard stainless steel, O-rings, and that's pretty much it. So I don't see a lot of things breaking, maybe replacing an O-ring every once in a while as they wear out, but that's really it. And that leads me into my second pro, is low cost of ownership. Something like the Linea Mini will cost you money in terms of maintenance, and there's gonna be things that need to get replaced. You're replacing gaskets, screens, baskets, you know, things like that on a pretty regular basis, so at least on a quarterly, if not bi-yearly basis. So this machine is going to have a low cost of ownership. I can also see this as a great learning or teaching tool. There's a lot of controllability here, understanding the theory of extraction based on pressure, things like that are relatively hard to wrap your head around when you're just letting a machine handle all those aspects. So this is a great option for someone who's running classes on espresso or just wants a little home machine that's not gonna cost them multiple thousands of dollars and don't really care about having a steam wand. And speaking of budget and pressure, this is a budget machine that you can do pressure profiling on. Pressure profiling is basically just being able to toy with the amounts of pressure being put on your espresso puck and buying a machine that does this is very expensive. This machine is also extremely portable. So if you travel, you camp, you wanna just have espresso on the road, this is a nice machine to have because literally you pack it into a nice little briefcase. It comes with you wherever you go. It's super simple to put together and take apart. It's just a great piece of equipment for those on the go. And lastly in the pro column, how does it taste? The espresso honestly is legitimate. It tastes like espresso that comes from a standard pump machine as long as you're paying close attention and that brings me to the cons list. If you feel like there's lots of preparation involved with regular espresso, this isn't the machine for you. There are multiple other steps added on top to the regular espresso preparation. And on top of that, there is even more added opportunity for human error because everything is controlled by you. The pressure and all those things are all you. So my final thoughts are this. This is a great machine for those who drink exclusively espresso without steamed milk. It makes espresso as good as a machine, but at the sacrifice of time and potentially more human error and consistency issues. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Follow me on Instagram at Prometheus, the blog at Prometheus.com. New videos every Friday. And as always, stay caffeinated, pony boy.